What's going on, everybody? Here and welcome back to some more No Man's Sky. So today we are going to go after probably some of the coolest ships I've ever seen in this game. Um, I am officially swapped over. I like the Sentinel intercept interceptor ships better than the living ships. I know that is uh that's a statement right there. But today we're going to go after um this ship. I'll show you where I got this one specifically. If you so if you want this one, I'll show you where to get that one. And then we're going to go after one other one that I saw on the portal or the portal coordinate exchange. So. You guys know what the, the no man's sky coordinate exchange if you just google it it's a no man's sky subreddit it's fantastic they have all the things and all the stuff and all the information but these ships it may not look like a lot but if you look at the wings check this out check out the coolest thing that i think i've ever seen on no man's sky these wings flip and fold out to be this amazing beautiful like long winged thing i mean like just absolutely look at that like how cool is it those wings flip over flip around and become this like amazing it's so cool it's like it's the coolest mechanic that i've seen um ship wings like ever do i've never seen ship wings do that on anything ever so um very cool but the uh this ship specifically I got on this planet. So we'll pop down into here and I'll give you some coordinates. So if you guys want the coordinates, you can have the coordinates. You can get all the coordinate goodness you want. Um, it is a, it's like a frozen planet. It's really cool. Uh, but we're gonna go, um, I wanna go try to find another one. Now it's gonna be another winged ship like this. It's gonna have like the wings that fold and flip and fold and flop and all the whatever they're called. I don't know what they're called, but they're super cool. So let's go ahead and let's land. Um, you know, I probably could use some more crystals anyways. Um, so my favorite thing, so let me, I just want to recap in case you missed it and in case you don't know why. Living ships were fantastic because they used very basic resources to refill all their, all their systems, right? These ships are even better because every single one of them can take a radiant shard. You can use these radiant shards and fill up everything. That was my warp core. Wait, no. That was, yeah. That was the warp drive that I just filled up. I can use the same thing to fill up my sublight drive. I can use the same thing to fill up my, wait, anti-gravity well suborbital. Oh no, this is a launch thruster fuel. You can use the same items to fill up the same things. It's amazing. It's absolutely amazing. So um, this guy right here is was located on this planet. So basically if you head over here, hold on, let me get a good picture for you. If you head to this planet, um, you put, you go to those, you got to put those coordinate, those portal, portal coordinates in right there at the bottom of the screen um use one of your um use one of your little echo deals and uh you'll, you'll be able to find one super easy so we're gonna go find one here and um I'll, I'll show you the whole process if you're not familiar with it uh but yeah this is oh, it's super cool i love it so let me go ahead let me head to the nexus um you do need to know where a portal's at and you need to have all your portal glyphs so if you don't have those uh, if you just play through the story long enough you'll get all of them given to you so I recommend that, but yeah, let's head over there. Hopefully you guys enjoy. If you do like, subscribe, all the fun things and leave a comment, let me know or join the discord if you'd like to um, and show me your favorite ships. Show me what you rock and what you're flying. I'd like to know. I'd like to see it. Uh, I can't do it. I can't, I can't place this here yet. How about now? No. How about now? Yeah, okay. All right, so we are at a portal. Now, like I said, you have to get a portal. You have to get the glyphs um, in order to be able to do this. So you would use the glyphs that I just gave you if you want to get the one that I have personally, or if you're gonna want to go after the same one that I'm going after right now, because I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I think the one that I'm about to go after might be my favorite and might become my new uh, my new go-to ship. There's another type that I really like. Um, it's, I think a lot of people are calling it like the trash hauler. It looks like a, like a garbage truck kind of thing or like a, like a um, like a uh, what's the word like a station wagon looking thing it looks pretty cool um but let's go ahead and let's check this one out so moon sunrise moon moon where's our triangle deal couple of those one of those maybe a dinosaur another sunrise a teepee um a weird looking face and then the galaxy and that should be it so let's go see if we can find this guy now i don't have the um the echo thing the locator thing so we're gonna have to fight some things we're gonna have to get one and then we'll have to uh locate it that way but oh, this is so exciting i'm really excited about this one specifically and that's why i want to make this video too because just showing you guys what's out there okay so now let's go ahead and make sure that we are actually on the right planet here okay good there's crystals all right so there are crystals 
Oh. There's a communication station. There's a communication station. There's a communication station. You know what? Let's pop over to one of these. Well, you know what? I don't have the... I don't have the mind anyways. So, you know, you know what? Let's go ahead and pop these open. I don't have the mind thing anyways. And we're going to have to go ahead and get a mind thing. So we have that. Oh, and then I also need the sail. Okay. So let's go ahead and let's do a couple things. Let's grab this bad boy. Oh, somebody built a little base here. That's neato. Oh, it's giant flying worms too. Let's go see what this comm station says. Okay, so here is a... You know what? Let's just do the fighting here. Why not? And then another thing I'm going to actually have to do is I'm going to have to actually swap ships because I think I'm at my maximum. What are the odds that this save and chart would actually tell us where the next where the location is of something? Minor settlement. Okay, so let's go ahead. Pulse splitter. All right, where are you at? Okay, so hey, look at system protected by No Man's Sky Explorers. Yeah, be gone. You can be gone too. Okay, so I got the inverted mirror, but we need the uh, we need the mind piece. And we need the um, the little echo location deal, or that's gonna tell us where to go. So I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna fight these bad boys. Oh, hello. The swarm is hunting. Where's the big guy at? Where's like the big tanky boy at? That's the one I'm looking for. Ah, you. You were the one that I'm looking for. Pretty sure you're the one that gives me what I want. Maybe not. I thought they were. I'm also playing with different uh, different camera angles because I don't. The first person seems a little close to me. I might need to adjust the field of view. I don't know. I've been playing other games lately and. Oh, hello. Oh, geez. Uh, I don't want to switch. Oh, here we go. All right, so there's one down. Where's my, do I not have a shield anymore? Apparently not. I need to get my shield back. Okay, did I get what I'm looking for here? No, I have not gotten... I have not gotten anything yet. Okay, so we're now we're on the fifth stage of the swarm here. <laughs> I still haven't found what I'm looking for. I love hitting him with the paralysis motor. It's so fun. Oh, wow, that guy has like a weird shield thing. Invisibility, and it's like messing with my graphics here. Hey, hey, hey. The little guys are annoying. Hey, there we go. Okay, so we did a scan. I was like, I'm, I still have not gotten the thing I was looking for. There's the dissonant spike detected. So that is going to be our ship. Unfortunately, they, they didn't give us the echo thing, so I'm not going to be able to see what the multi-tools. Ah, it's going to be right over there. That one. Um, okay, but I also did not get the... I also didn't get the mind either that we needed to, uh, that we're gonna need, but that's fine. Let's go ahead, let's head over there. Let's go check this bad boy out, because like I said, I think this is gonna be probably my new go-to ship from now on, so we'll see. We'll see what it looks like. All right, let's see, is this the right one? Oh, it looks like it is. Oh, don't tell me my game just froze. Okay, so my game crashed last time I came up to this one. Um, okay, so let's go ahead and park this here. Now I need to, like I said, I think I got, I think I have to switch my ship out. Unfortunately, 
Um, so let's do summon vehicle. Let's go and summon a different ship. Okay, so that was my starter. That's the golden vector. That's my living ship. Um, you know what? A solar sail. Oh, one of these solar sail. Oh, you know what? That's my go-to solar sail ship. That was my first one. Um, and you know what? Actually, this one. I don't like this one. This it, it's kind of cool. Uh, because it's kind of like really small, but you know what? I'm not, I'm not a fan of it. So we'll go ahead and swap that one out. All right. So the <laughs> nice ship. Yeah. So this is the one that we want. So it's the same as mine, except it doesn't have this whole front stuff. It's very uh, narrow and sharp. So let's go and take a peek at it. Oh, there's a Hylian Brain. Oh, that's where I get it from. Okay. So we've got everything except for the Harmonic Brain. Okay, cool. So let's go get that bad boy done. Oh, this is super cool. Uh, let's go ahead and probe the subconscious. Let's go grab this. Hopefully it's not too far away. Ah, it's right over there. Perfect. Oh my gosh. This is a gravity storm. I've never been in a gravity storm before. I've never been in a gravity storm before. This is so cool. How does it mess with your ship? Does it mess with your ship at all? Not really. Okay. Oh, that is so cool. I've never been in a gravity storm before. I've like, I've looked for planets that had it. I've never been in one. That's really neat. I'm guessing those giant balls of purple are probably not good for you, but you know what it is. It is what it is. <laughs> Look at all the purple balls of floaty floaty. Oh, this is so cool. I was wondering, I was like, man, I'm floating really high and I'm not coming down very fast. This is so trippy. I love it. It's like you're on a low gravity planet. Okay. Yes, 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 all this stuff. Uh, present the brain. We're going to get the brain. It's going to get super hot to the touch. We just need to take this back so we can claim our ship. Please. Thank you. All right. We're good. I'm so excited to go to claim the ship. So basically, it is this. I think it's the smallest version of the folding wing ships you can get. Um, I could be wrong. There might be one without the nose piece on it. But I feel like it's. I don't know. I feel like it's pretty. And it looks pretty sharp too with the nose piece that it has on it. It's very like. Um, it looks extremely aerodynamic. It looks like a, like a dart, <laughs> you know? And if I'm not mistaken, if, if I'm not mistaken, I mean, I could be wrong here. It might be an S class, which none of my ships so far are an S class. Um, the ship that I, I think that one's a B class or C class. It says S class red. Oh my gosh. It is an S class. Oh my gosh. So compare. I don't think I can. Yeah, I can't add it, but I can swap. Wait. Hold on. Oh, okay. This is the one we're swapping. Yeah, that's the little one. This is the new one. Swap ships. Oh my gosh. This is it. This is, I think this is my favorite ship. See, look at how small it is. It's just so small it's it's so absolutely perfectly small okay hold on let's let's get let's get some photo ops in here and let's move the sun to like right here so we can actually look at this bad boy you see what i'm talking about hold on let's go up that right there is my favorite ship how cool is that it's just super narrow super small folding wing like it is like this looks like it would be the fast it just would be super fast you know it looks like it'd be so much fun oh my gosh this is so cool so we've got uh it's s class we've got i mean we've got a lot of slots already available here we're gonna deck this thing out we're gonna upgrade it we're gonna do all the things this is gonna become my new main ship my new mainstay um it's fast it feels fast feels very nimble too. Ooh, it's 
fun to fly. All right, let's pop out here. Oh, this is just, this is exactly what I wanted. All right, so if we wanted to get some upgrades for this bad boy, we need to get, um, oh man, I don't even know what we, I don't even know what we need to get for this. Sentinel cannon, uh, Sentinel ship gun, Sentinel grade weapon system. So peak damage potential is 326 DPS. Now I wonder, I'm actually kind of curious if we grab the Nexus, can we pull in, um, is there upgrades? Can we go to the, like, is there like ship specific? Well, actually, you know what? Hold on. Let's see. So we've got infra knife, but we don't have anything like uh sentinel specific. So my curious, like, am I, can I upgrade this sentinel cannon? Cause like, what is a sentinel cannon? It's just like a blue, like a regular cannon. Okay. I don't know. Let's go see if we can't. Oh, you know what? It might be. It might be this kind of stuff. Sentinel weapon shard. So, uh, so, yeah, we're probably gonna have to fight ships. Possibly in order to get Sentinel upgrades. But you know what? Let's just take a look anyways, just to make sure. Oh my gosh, I love that wing animation. It is like the coolest thing. And it's so lit, like the ship is so little overall too. It's just, it's so cool. The smallest ship with the coolest wing animation. I love it. All right, so starship upgrades. I, like I said, I don't think they're gonna be here, but we gotta just look just to make sure. Research starship upgrades. Okay, so we've got, no, I don't see anything in the ways of, no, I don't see anything in the ways of the Sentinel upgrades. So my guess is that we're probably going to have to take out Sentinel ships in order to get those Sentinel upgrades. Um, you know what? Well, actually, what does my starship have on it currently? 326. I mean, that's not great. Oh, any radiant shards. Oh, shoot. Um, that's not how many shields of any type. I mean, I guess we have an Aeron shield. Okay, so let's go ahead. I need to grab, um, I need to, <laughs> I need to grab my, uh, my crystals out of my other ship. And then I think we're gonna do a little bit of fighting here. I want to see if we can get some upgrades for the Sentinel class ships. Now I'm hoping my other Sentinel ship is actually in here. Yes. think you're it right no you're not it uh wait wait a second that should have been it huh well darn <laughs> i don't have any crystals i don't think um so his heart, I don't, I mean, those are worth money, but I need the actual crystals. I had them in, I thought it was this ship. I had them in here somewhere. It's a, it's a different one though. It's not this ship. Cause I have two ships that look similar. I think I have this one and I think I have another one. And then I also have this guy right here. Oh, uh, we're gonna have to go to the planet surface and get these. That's fine. You know, so I did just realize too that this planet is almost like a paradise planet with sentinel stuff on it. Uh, that's pretty cool. Actually, you know what? That actually really makes me want to find the um, one of the outposts because what if I wonder if the um, the multi tool is an S class? Because I don't have an S class multi tool yet. I have a I think mine's an A class. No, mine's a B. It's the right color scheme and everything, but it's not. And you know what? The color scheme might be right too. If it's this one, we need to look. All right, perfect. Let's go ahead and let's start a fight here and let's, uh, let's get into, let's get into a fight and see if we can't get some upgrades for this. I don't know that we necessarily can, 
I'm not actually sure that's how you get upgrades for these, but I'm going to, because you, we get upgrades for our multi-tools, it seems like, um, by fighting the people on the ground. So maybe if we fight the people in the sky, we'll get sky-related upgrades. Honestly, just have to find somebody to shoot. <gasps> there we go. Perfect. Interceptors on approach. Let's go, buddies. Let's go. I want to see how this fights. Uh, not bad. It ain't good, though. Oh, it, it's not good. <laughs> uh, yeah, we definitely need some upgrades here. Now, I could get, like, the infra knife and stuff like that, but I was kind of... I'm kind of hoping that I could keep a sentinel, you know what I mean? All right, we're gonna go ahead and pop into space here too because I want to be able to take out the dreadnought. Hostile ships on approach. Let's do this. Give me some upgrades. Let's go. All right, we got interceptors to five stars. Hopefully we get a dreadnought here soon. I should go ahead and repair that. Are you can get a dreadnought soon or what? Let's go. Yes. Dreadnought. Okay, let's go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, holy moly. They are like melting my face. Pretty sure we can go like right underneath of them. Okay, we need to disable their cannons. Hold on, I gotta get like away. We gotta turn around. Can we cycle? All right, this is not going as good without my uh, my other ship. <laughs> My other ship, I have like, you know, much, much better shields and uh, weapons and stuff on. This one's not so great, but we're going to make it happen. All right. So now I think we can focus fire on. We're going to take out these guns. Cause those guns are causing issues for us now i'm pretty sure we could take out the big oh uh oh we got more guns up here another gun up there blow up these big huge balls here <laughs> You know what? Let's go ahead and take out the other guns on the other side, too. Let's get these guns taken out. Then we don't have to worry about them. Perfect. Okay. Let's go ahead and take these guys out. I don't think we've gotten any upgrades yet. I'm just saying, but you know, it is what it is. All right, we got one final pass here on this guy. And he's going to be done here in a second. Come on, let's go. Boom, baby. That is it. Capital ship defeated Sentinel forces retreating. My gosh, we've done the thing. Rare item found. Dreadnought AI fragment. Whoa. Battleship core room a single splinter of a colossal mainframe in the heart of the capital ship. It blinks a solitary living eye. Trained upon one piece. Last known location on one of its fleet's interceptors. Okay, so that's going to give us one of the interceptors. Did we get anything else from this entire thing? No, we did not. <laughs> 
So that will give me the location of an interceptor, but it's going to give me the location of the interceptor I just found. So we did all of that and got absolutely no upgrades. So I'm thinking what we're probably just going to have to do is just trying to think if there's any other way to get Sentinel upgrades. You know what I'm saying? I don't, I don't know that there is. So um, the Sentinel cannon might just be it is what it is. Uh, we might just have to throw some infra knives on here. Might have to throw, just throw some, you know, standard standard weaponry on here. But you know, I'm not above that. I'm not above that. I was hoping to keep everything Sentinel, you know. Um, but yeah, if you guys are getting Sentinel upgrades for your uh, your ships, leave a comment. Let me know. So I'm curious because I was kind of hoping during all of that that I would I would find something. But like, I don't think I honestly don't even know how much of anything we got to be completely honest. So I mean, maybe there's a Sentinel. Cause we got a weapons shard and then like a, an exosuit fragment. I mean, maybe, maybe. Can I put this in here? That's uh, I overdid it. <laughs> um, hmm. Core health, shield strength. Yeah, I don't, I don't see anything. So yeah, but yeah, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think. But that is gonna end it. Thank you so much for coming out. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, like, subscribe, all the fun things, and I will see you in the next one. Bye, everybody.